So you've heard that issue of people getting getting high, right? It doesn't take much research or understanding of what's really happening. You're causing damage to the brain that's putting the body in a euphoric state of not feeling pain. And I, I've, I've studied Narcotics Anonymous and Alcoholics Anonymous, whereby they're big into getting your emotions out. And that's the big thing that people do when they, they, they want to hide the emotions. They don't want to feel the pain. But yeah, you don't want to feel pain, any kind of pain. I'm thinking about, you know, the marijuana. That's supposed to be a painkiller, you know? It's like it re relax you, you know, kind of thing. And you got your meth. You got your cocaine. Cocaine is anything at the end of an a, a like that is a painkiller. Obviously, you've got heroin that just wipes out pain in your whole body. They use that in um, UK and other countries for the birthing. And well, fentanyl is the only country that uses that is in the United States of America. But these are all painkillers, people. All all your drugs. It's just to get rid of. It's just putting your body in a take away pain mode. It's not getting you high. 